talk about it because you guys are a relationship on full display uh, mm -hmm. on a reality TV show. <laughs> one of the top reality shows there is out there, Real Housewives of Atlanta. Yeah. And so you guys aren't afraid to share. So I want to ask you guys this question. It turns out there's a study that says roasting your partner can be healthy. So basically, basically talking that ish to one another mm -hmm. can help foster a beautiful thing. Do you yeah. guys agree with this, this thought process? As uh, long as it doesn't cut too deep, you know, right. I think we know how to push each other's buttons in a relationship and sometimes you can cross the line. Yeah. Um, but no, I think having fun and comedy is definitely one of the things that helps and fosters Definitely. a really healthy relationship for sure. But we go in on right. each other. Every night. <laughs> what do you roast each other about? Man, all types of stuff. We talk about each other's heads. Yeah, talk you about know. each other's butts. Talk right. about each other's like noses and feet. You know, right. everything. Stuff, right? But it builds character. You know, it helps you to come up with those quick comebacks yeah. <laughs> that you, you definitely need. Yeah. Definitely. Some of the stuff we did behind the scenes definitely prepared Shamari for the Real Housewives. For sure. <laughs> She's well versed yes. to the drama. She'll be all well right. Versed. Yeah, I think that's what I love in, in my relationship. I'm married, and uh, some of his roasts, there'll be some truth to it. He'll be like, are you wearing that? Yeah. And it'll be in a joking <laughs> way, but it's right. how he says it. And it's like, oh, wait, maybe I should go change. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I feel but like. But it's good. Yeah. It helps. It's all about intention, right? So if somebody, yeah. like, hits you too hard and it's actually something you're insecure about, right. you're like, right. why are you saying this to me? Exactly. But if you know it's funny, it's all good. Well, right? I, got, I got an interesting one because you guys are obviously so talented music. Is there ever a time where you're like, hey, I got this this sound or this sounds hot, and you'll just, will you be like, no, that's whack? Will you be, <laughs> if oh. it's not hitting, will you guys be open and honest and maybe roast in that scenario? Oh, yeah. yeah of course, yeah. You have, <laughs> you have to be honest with music, yeah. you know, as artists. It's like, that's something we do. We give each other, you know, positive feedback. And mm -hmm. so, yeah, I think that we definitely will be honest in that situation. Yeah, every now and then I put a song on the table and Shamari is like, ah, uh ah, -uh, it's not going that one, not feeling that one. And then other times, um, we kind of take a back seat to each other's vision, you know, where it's like, okay, well, whatever you see fit for us, and it'll turn around like, yo, I'm glad I followed your lead on that one because it turned out being a mm -hmm. nice song or whatever. Real quick before we take, oh, go ahead, please. Well, I was gonna say, remember how you came at Candy on the show about how she needs to get yeah. her, placement. her placement, yeah. placement together? Right. Yes. Do you talk to her about her girl group and then how yes. do you handle that? <laughs> um, and uh, like, not the songs that they do, but as far as their performance is concerned, one of the things and the reasons why I think we're still here 30 plus years later is because we put so much into being entertainers, right? Mm -hmm. I mean, practice, practice, practice. So when the light was shined on us, we were prepared. So anything that I can do to lend to their performance side mm -hmm. of things, I'm definitely cracking that whip on them right. in, in the <laughs> rehearsal studio for there sure. You go.